Hey guys, in this tutorial, I will go to show how to fully optimize your computer for best performance, and any limitation is due to the hardware. First, you want to disable unnecessary Windows animations. To do that, press Start, right click Computer, Properties, under Advanced System Settings, Performance, press Settings, and Adjust for Best Performance. Under Advanced, you would want to set your virtual memory and tick to make sure that it's automatically managing page file size. Press OK, Apply, OK. Do not accept to restart the computer. Next, you want to disable unnecessary startup items. To do this, press Start, type in msconfig under the Startup tab. Disable all startup items. Next, click the programs that you do want to start up with your computer. For instance, I would like my antivirus and my Razor equipment. Press apply and do not accept to restart. After doing that, you would like to set the power options of your computer for maximum performance. To do this, go to control panel, type in power options, Then, under the preferred plans, click for high performance. Also, when your computer turns on, it takes a while to load all the desktop icons. To hide them, right click the desktop and click and under view, untick show desktop icons. Now, you want the graphics settings to be minimalist. To do this, go to your graphics control panel and try to find where to set the preset for maximum performance. In the NVIDIA control panel, all I need to go to is adjust image settings and then use the preferred performance emphasis. Now it's best to restart your computer. And after you've done that, you want to make sure that the proper amount of CPU and RAM is being used. Right click the taskbar and press Start Task Manager. Under the Performance tab, make sure neither CPU or memory are exceeding 80%. If they are, you're likely needing to upgrade your CPU or add more RAM to your motherboard. If you want to find out what's using up so much processing power, go to Processes and click the CPU tab to find the culprit programs. If you know what you're doing, it will be best for you to upgrade your graphics driver. To do that, go onto the manufacturer's website and type in the name of your graphics card to find its latest supporting drivers. If you don't know what graphics card you have, Here's how to find it. By pressing Start, right click Computer, Properties, Device Manager, and then under the Display Adapters is the name of your graphics card. If you're really concerned about performance, you're able to overclock your CPU to increase its clock speed. To do this, you'll need to press a specialist key while the computer is turning on to access BIOS. In BIOS, there will be a CPU settings page where you're able to Apply a preset of higher performance or enter in a greater clock speed and voltage. You want to be careful when doing this as your computer may not start up or has issues processing due to speeds that it can't keep up with. You're also able to overclock the refresh rate of your monitor. For me, all I need to do is right click the desktop and go to my graphics control panel under change resolution. I can create a customized resolution that supports the higher refresh rates. If you test it and it works, congratulations, your monitor can produce a custom refresh rate greater than factory. You want to make sure that your monitor is running at the quickest refresh rate that it can. Right click desktop under screen resolution, advanced settings, monitor. Then you want to hit the drop box for the screen refresh rate and click the highest hertz. Thanks for watching my tutorial. I hope it helps you out a lot. 